Welcome back all you sports and gambling fans out there. Today we're doing some NBA betting coverage and joining me here is Dave Golikoff, our very own SBR contributor. The game we're looking at here is the Miami Heat going all the way to New Orleans to play the Pelicans. All right, man, two and one yesterday with your NHL picks. Uh, I think that writing Hannah Davis actually paid off, man. Uh, but what do you think we should actually, you know, change this around and play with different girls? Um, just to keep it interesting, you know, how about we do this time Elsa Hosk or maybe Lily Aldridge? Um, I, I can't help it, man. I caught that Victoria's Secret swimsuit uh, shoot yesterday, and it was pretty damn good. What do you think? Hey, anytime you say the words riding in Hannah Davis, I'm all in. <laughs> all right, cool, man. All right, well, let's get down to business. Now, first off, uh, let's take a quick look at the Heat. Now, so far, they are 5-5 five and five in their last 10 games, and they're coming into this one favored by 1.5 one points. Now, they just barely got the win at Orlando this past Wednesday, 93-90 to 90 in overtime. And looking a bit back further to this past Saturday's game where they actually played at home against New Orleans, they lost that one 91-105, to 105, man. So, Dave, I mean, what are the chances of them actually winning this game right now that they're going to New Orleans if they couldn't even get the job done less than a week ago at home? Well, he had been a better team on the road this season than at home. A little bizarre, but... Uh... You know, that's just been their M.O., and this is a team that uh, might be a little better this time around. You know, at that point, they're kind of getting Dragic, Dragic into the lineup and integrated and all that. Now he's kind of had a couple games with the team, sort of the new chemistry. Um, you know, they've also got Michael Beasley coming in tonight, some reinforcements for the loss of Chris Bosh. You know, some of those factors could tip the scales in their favor tonight if you like the Heat. Well, not really, actually. I mean, since Chris Bosh is out, it's the, you can actually see that they haven't been playing that well. Anyways, let's look at the other side of the court. Now, the Pelicans, they had two big casualties of, them, of themselves, man. They lost Davis and they lost Anderson to injuries on that game on Saturday, you know, when they actually beat the Heat. Now, they're coming into this game riding on a three-game winning streak. So now, now that they have home court advantage, I mean, don't you think it's going to be a lot easier from, for them to get another win, man? I think so. Uh, I mean, the, the other case, of course, is that it's tough to win these sort of quick home-and-home home series. Um, but, uh, no, I, I do like the Pelicans in this spot. They're at home. Uh, they've been playing well, even without Anthony Davis, even without uh, Ryan Anderson in the lineup. You know, oddly enough, one of the players coming to, uh, to them in the trades was Norris Cole from the Heat. You know, deemed more of like a throw-in than anything else, but he's played very well for the Pelicans. Uh, kind of running the offense a little bit, uh, chipping in with offense around 10 points per game, which is more than he gave Miami, and playing very good defense uh, at the point guard position. So that's going to be the interesting matchup again here tonight. Dragic going against uh, Norris Cole, who's played very well uh, off the ball and on the ball defense for uh, the Pelicans since coming over. So I, I do like the Pelicans in this spot. They have some momentum going. They're at home. Um, those are sort of the two main factors that you have here with the Pelicans. All right, man, but are you liking them enough? I mean, right now the Heat are being favored by one and a half points, and it kind of looks like everybody is actually grabbing that one and a half point. Is that what you're going to do in this case? Uh, I'm going to take the points with the Pelicans in this spot. This is a team that, uh, as mentioned, has won three straight, plays well at home, better at home than on the road. Um, you know, Full disclosure, this is a pretty ugly game to be betting, uh, but, you know, sometimes the games are on the schedule and we just make the picks. So in this one, I'm leaning more more towards the Pelicans than I am the Heat. I think, uh, you know, seeing them go on the road to Miami and win, uh, pro it, it indicates to me that now that they have the home ice, the home ice, home court advantage, <laughs> that they can win in this spot again versus the Heat, who are now on the road. All right, man. All right, let's uh, put our faith in Lily Aldridge on, on this one then, man. Anyways, Dave, a lot of uh, thanks for all the, the insights and the pick here, man. We'll talk again on Monday. Everyone else, don't forget to check back with Dave tomorrow for some more sports coverage and your free picks. Till then, for SBR Picks, this is Dax Lloyd.